Hi. Today I'm going to show you how I converted a uh, 20th century butcher knife into an 18th century butcher knife. Um, the blade shape was already okay. Um, sometimes they do need reshaping. Um, the main difference between a 20th century and an 18th or 19th century knife is that the 20th century handle on a knife is riveted and the 18th and 19th century knives were pinned. 18th century knives would have anything from no pins at all to one pin to three pins. Um, 19th century knives would very often have four or five pins in the handle. Uh, if it's a 19th century knife and it's got four or five pins in it, personally, I wouldn't worry about changing it. Um, but if it's a 20th century knife and it has rivets in the handle, then it stands out like a sore thumb. And you need to do something with it. And that's what I did with this one. Um, I took the handle off and I made a new handle and I used pins to put the new handle onto the knife and I also changed the shape of the tang slightly. I'll show you some stills of the knife beforehand and some still shots of the knife afterwards. And, uh, and of course the video on the process of how I did it. There are no doubt other ways of making a new handle and putting a new handle on. Um, I'm not saying this is the best way, I'm just saying this is the way I did it. Uh, it's a fairly simple way. Um, I didn't go out of my way to, uh, to split logs or anything like that and take timber off and cut it down. I used a piece of, uh, a piece of heavy dowel for the handle and I reshaped it to fit. And uh, I'll show you the process of doing that. Okay. We'll do that now. Thanks.